Okay, today I'm going to show you uh, the Tech One Hobby Gent. This is the Gent from Tech One. It is made of EPP foam. As you can see, this is the EPP foam. Uh, we have the PRJ as well as the Malibu F3P. The PRJ and the Gent are both made of EPP foam. All right, and uh, the Malibu F3P is made of deep prone foam, but the three of them has almost the same wingspan and the same wing loading, and both. I mean, all of them uses the two cells, uh, 800 milliamps, 7.4 volt. You can go 10C or 15C, but try not to exceed 15C because what we rec what, what we're going to recommend you are uh, is this little uh, ESC here. This is a Tech One 10 amp ESC. Okay, it has a burst of 12 amps. So please take note that uh, your your battery should shouldn't exceed about more than 15C. At the bottom of this plane, you will see three servos. This, work, this works on a, a four channel. Uh, this being the aileron servo. You don't have to plug in channel 1 and channel 6 for Futaba radios. You just plug into the aileron channel, which is channel 1. It uses uh, one servo horn uh, with a V-link like this. Okay, like those uh, GWS uh, e-starters. Uh, you can use just one servo to control both ailerons. Okay, and one servo here controls the uh, elevator and the other one controls the rudder so it is that simple uh, we have done all the cross braces by the carbon rods all are provided inside the kit and all the linkages and the clevises and of, of course the, uh, the control horns are all also provided now I'm using the 800 milliamps two cell 15C and the position of the battery is well recommended over here as you can see when I flip the plane over if I grab it at the one third from the leading edge right about here if I grab it it almost balance right at the center now of course you can you can swap the position of the uh, battery by shifting backwards or forward depends on your your liking some may like it very very tail heavy so they will shift the uh, battery right to the back over here and they will do a lot of funny and wild style uh, 3d okay for me I'm just comfortable to be here and here now in a while I'm going to show you how this thing hover hover okay with this two cell battery and it weighs uh, about 250 grams all up okay and also in the packing tag one has provided you as shown in the picture on the outside of the box these are the spoiler runs okay these spoiler runs are supposed to attach on the wing but I'm not going to do that today uh, the purpose of these spoiler runs is for you to slow down the downline okay when you die vertical down okay this is very good for f3p now for the <coughs> indoor schedule uh, where you are required to do downline upline knife edge and whatnot okay for the downline it is very important that you have to slow down almost the same speed as the upline so that's the purpose of the uh, spoiler runs which is provided here all right all these are like like air brakes okay for 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 you to slow down the downline Okay, so in a while I'm going to show you the hovering. This is the hovering in a very constrained space. So this Tech One Hobby uh, Gen is well capable of hovering and top rolling in, in a very constrained space. So uh, in a while we'll be back and I'll show you uh, uh, all these things. Okay, check this out. <laughs> 